What was it about production that you liked more than sort of being the host of a show? It's a good question. When you are the host, like you very are, very much are at the mercy of someone else, you know? Like if you, you know, think you might be the perfect person for a program for whatever reason, it's ultimately not your decision. You know, they might want a female or they might want someone that's got a certain accent. And there's certain things about yourself or myself, obviously we can't change. So what I love about production is that I get to create the narrative. I get to create the story and I get to bring it to life. You know, I wanted to be creating shows. I wanted to be selling shows uh, and I wanted to be making them. And making them is really tough. That series on life in Antarctica, they distributed to say 20 odd countries around the world. And I was like, oh great, when do I get, you know, when's my paycheck come through for that? And they're like, well, what do you mean? Like you're in-house talent. And it was that moment for me where I was like, oh, okay, I actually don't understand the business of television. I didn't understand IP. I didn't understand how copyright works. I didn't understand who owns the program and who doesn't. And so I've always had a fascination with that. And in 2008, I moved to New York and with, you know, big dreams, I wanted to learn the business of TV. I wanted to make shows in the US. I didn't know a single contact. It was so naive. I was 25, I decided to move to New York and I was going to make it in America. And, and honestly, I bought a book on the business of television. I've still got it at home. And I just sat there and like and read it. I was like, okay, how do all of these things work? And just started absorbing as much literature as I could. And like a lot has changed in the media industry since then. So a lot of it doesn't hold up. Mm. But it was my first entry point into like, okay, I was willing to learn. Like I, I, I had to learn the, the business of TV. And I, oh, sorry, not the business, how to make TV. And I remember, you know, some fond memories are being in the middle of small town Australia. And after shooting all day, we'd sit in the motel room, crack a beer, and myself and our cameraman, who was in his 50s or 40s, like really great operators, we'd plug the camera into the TV, and we'd just sit there and watch everything we shot for the day. And sort of like, oh, does this work? You know, how can we do it better tomorrow? So like, it really was sort of mooching off these pros in the industry and learning how to uh, produce.